Alright, so what is this? Shout out to boy Chris Bell with another video, man. As y'all can see, we reacted to DDG gave up on Ruby Rose. Plus, when Queen gets exposed, his plus when Queen gets exposed, his pigs leaked. I right, that was not good grammar. Plus, Tark his ex Jada boyfriend. Okay, man, we really just here for this right here. We're just here for the GDG, man. It's gonna be crazy. Pretty sure they broke up. They broke up officially now. I mean, let's get straight into the video. We probably won't watch all of it because I don't really care about all this. I just want to watch this. Hey, man, it's your boy, the extra plug, and today we got a lot to talk about. So today we're gonna be talking about DDG. Shout out to Extra Plug, man. We're gonna be down Megan below. McQueen. But the first topic we're gonna be talking about, my man Chizzy Chark. So if stay you, sanitized, so as you guys by the way. Know, stay sanitized. Chizzy Chark, Black Chargo has had a lot of girlfriends, and you know, I'm not gonna lie, he has a really good roster. You know, the curly head, light skinned baddies. Y'all, y'all, we all know that's Chark's type. So you know, he made a post on Twitter that kind of it kind of seemed like he was sneak this in one of his ex girlfriends. But I honestly think it was Jada. But before I speak any longer on this topic, I'm going to read the tweet he made on Twitter. So this is what he said. My favorite ex-girlfriend broke. So broke it make me want to donate. Now that's, you know, that's 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 a that's a deep sneak this. Yeah. So I'm going to just say who I think it is. Not who I know it is. I think it is. I feel like, you know, it. I feel like it's Jada Moore. Jada Moore is his boyfriend. Y'all know Jada Moore, she's booed up with her new boyfriend and stuff, y'all. And Jada Moore, fine. Let's let me let me let me just take a moment of silence to just acknowledge like Jada Moore is fine. Like she really fine. I know y'all don't like when I say that, but I'm I'm not finna change how I am for y'all. I don't care. Mm -hmm. But yeah, Jada Moore fine, bruh. She fine. I, I think she's very attractive. So, you know, she has a new boyfriend. So, I don't... I feel like, you know, this Loki might be a sneak this to Jada Moore's boyfriend. But at the same time, you know, I don't know. She could have... She could... You know, he could be talking about Stephanie. He could be talking about Stephanie because, you know, she's not as, you know, known. She's not... She's not, like, in the YouTube scene like that. So... And he did almost get engaged to her. So, he might be talking about Stephanie. Because, you know, he almost got engaged. So, it would make sense if that was his favorite girlfriend. But the thing is, Stephanie doesn't seem like she actually has a boyfriend because, oh, I don't know if she's just keeping it a secret. And if she did have a boyfriend, I don't think Chizzy Chark would know about that. So, to sum it up, I feel like he's talking about Jada. Mm -hmm. And if he is, you know, that's, you know, I feel like people don't concentrate on, you know, the sneak this is these YouTubers be making towards, you know, other. And I know it's not something you really should concentrate on. I'm a drama channel, so of course yeah, I'm going to talk yeah, about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you're not a drama channel, you really should not be concentrating on stuff like that. But... He's, you know, it just seems like he's, you know, sneak this in Jada Moore. And he's not talking about Diamond Nicole because him and Diamond Nicole were not dating. That was all, you know, for views. You know, they, I'm sure they got a whole bag off of that little fake relationship they had. But Jada Moore is a female he actually dated. Honey Bee, you know, I, would, I don't feel like Honey he would Bee, diss Honey me. Bee's, you know, I don't think I Honey, Honey Bee even has a boyfriend. That's another thing. The only no, ex I can sure think of do. that has a boyfriend is Jada. And Jada, she, well, I'm not going to say nothing else about I be that. Seeing her on Jada TikTok. Moore, I be seeing Honey Bee on TikTok with this guy. Four. That's the only female that he's, you know, been with that has a boyfriend now that I know of. You know, he he might have some other girlfriends we don't know about. Like I said, All right, man. we're going to be talking about right, what's up? What's up, Megan McQueen. McQueen. So y'all know Megan McQueen reacts to my video. Shout out to him. But we got to talk about this. So I saw this. So one of my, you know, one of my followers on Instagram sent me this post and it was like a link to a Twitter a Twitter page and I clicked on it. It was not a Twitter. It was like to a Twitter post. I clicked on it and I saw this man, Megan McQueen's. I saw stuff I didn't want to see. And as you can see, I screenshotted it for, for the video and I blurred everything out. Not on no, not on no GAY stuff. Like I just so I could show y'all I'm not making this up because a lot of y'all like saying I report. I don't report fake news. I took a screenshot I could, so I could show y'all that I'm not lying. If y'all want to see, and if you want to see, then that's tough. You G-A-Y. The only reason why I'm talking about it is because I want to make a video about it. I want to have something to talk about. So, yeah, he made this. So, not he. Some person, you know, they made a um, um, a freaking Twitter page. And, it's as you said, it says YouTubers exposed and stuff like that. Mm. So, as you as you guys can see, 
you know, I blurred out, I blurred out, I blurred it all out. But the question is, like, I thought Megan McQueen, I thought the whole reason for Megan McQueen to start OnlyFans was so he could like have girls on there. Mm -hmm. Like, I didn't know the OnlyFans was for him to have, you know, himself. And I thought people were gonna be paying for him to go crazy on females, not to see just him. Now that's tough. Now them sus videos might be right, Megan McQueen. You might be, you might be a little sus because who? Because females are rarely, females rarely pay, bro. Let me tell you this, bro. Females are not really the main ones paying for OnlyFans. It's the males, bro. I say 90% of, I just, 90% of people buying OnlyFans is males. 90% because females can get D a lot easier than males can get P. And yes, I have to use initials. Yes, I have to use initials. Like, All right, hold up, bro. It's tough. You know, I'm I don't sure. care what y'all gotta say. I just really were here for the DG, yo. You gonna see, and, and if you, you wanna watch the original videos, it'll be down below. Thing about, I don't know. So, oh, yeah, 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 female, okay, here we go, here we go. Or, Cause I thought he was that man. We gonna move on to the next time. Let me let me know what y'all think about that. Cause that caught me off guard. Cause I thought he was, oh, I thought he, I thought it. he was posting stuff with him going crazy on females, not himself. Now that no, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. But yeah, we are gonna move on to the next topic. So the final topic, we are gonna be talking about DDG. So, as you guys know, DDG, okay, DDG, I'm really not going to give, I'm not really going to give my opinion on their opinion on their relationship, because at this point, it's obviously just fake. It's obviously for publicity, because he made a post on Twitter, and I'm going I'm to talk more about it after I read it. So, this is what he said. He said, all my relationships end the same way. I give up. So, I don't know if this is just an Aquarius thing, or a Terry, you know, son, it's, bro, I remember... I remember, um, like, you know, DDG's a Libra. Literally, that's what he literally stayed talking about him being a Libra. And if you're a Libra, you're going to, like, be famous one day. He's not an Aquarius Libra. Uh, he, po he made a post on Twitter and said that, you know, oh, Libra thing. He said it was just a Libra thing that he said that Ruby Rose was with him right now. It's just a Libra thing. That's BS. Ruby Rose was feeling some type of way at the time. And they ended up probably making up, and that's probably y'all really don't know what goes behind closed doors. I don't know behind closed doors, and I really don't either. I really don't either. Yes, I'm talking in circles. Deal with it, bro. Shut up. God. What? But yeah, so. I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna give my opinions on if if it was real and if it was fake. And if it's fake, if this is just for publicity, then you know I I salute DDG because he is making sure us plug channels eat. Cause I could care less X. if it's if it's for publicity. I don't. I, mean, I'm not I a could plug care channel, less. But... I really could care less, bro. Like a lot of y'all are always saying like, oh, it's just for publicity, man. Smart. He's letting us plug channels eat. Then he's letting us plug channels eat. If his if he's just doing this Ruby Rose relationship thing. For publicity, because he knows tweets he make is gonna make us plug channels talk about. Him. He knows that the shade room teens could possibly pick it up and then have people talking about him. Mm. But that would be if it's for publicity. And another thing, if it's not for publicity, then I don't know what to say because it's hard for me to give my advice on a relationship that I don't even think is you know I don't even know, bro. Because it's clear that you know whatever i know i know they tweet based on how they are feeling at the moment yes with the ch tweet yes with the ch i know they tweet based on how they are feeling at the moment you know it's not everything's for publicity but then some things are these youtubers like ddg really be in his mansion having all the la crew members come over and he be having he has a drawing board discussing what the next thing is gonna probably get people to talk about him and i'm gonna talk about him these other drama channels gonna talk about him, and it's gonna keep happening. If every time I see him make a tweet like that, it just it, it just be having me thinking like, oh, I gotta make a video on this. I have to make a video on this. But I don't know. You know, they did delete each other's posts on Instagram, but I don't. I'm not gonna base anything off of them following each other mm. or them deleting posts off Instagram oh. because it just doesn't mean anything at this point. Mm. I feel like they unfollow each other on purpose so then people wouldn't. People wouldn't like know whether they stop effing with each other. Hey man, all I gotta say is get that bag, bro. Whatever you gotta do, just get the bag. Whether it is you gotta just start some fake beef or whatever, just get the bag, man. But anyways, that's my video, y'all, man. It's your boy CCR. I'm out. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, man. We're on the road to 100 subscribers, man. But anyways, CCR out.